I think this is the sort of book, and we've seen it so far just being on the road, um, where people get really honest and open. And I feel like this, this book almost creates that atmosphere. People want to share their stories of, you know, oh, this kid in my class doesn't have his, he's raised by his grandparents, or this child, um, his father just got deported and he really connects with this character. Um, his father looks like the guy with the tattoos on the bus. So I think it just sort of validates people's experience and it's been really positive. Yeah. And I think for me, um, you know, this is a book that features a diverse character, but it's in a story that's not overtly about diversity. And I think that's the new move that, that is being made in, in quote unquote diverse literature. And that's important. Um, and then I see two different reactions, you know, from young people. Diverse kids take ownership of it. It's like, oh, this is my book. This is about me. This is about my community. But I also love when I get to meet kids that are from the wealthier suburbs and they sort of take ownership of the book too. And I feel like in, in that way, it's creating like more empathetic readers and, and young people. <laughs>